Unknown race is the new meta. Unknown race is the new meta. Ah, uh, yes. Unknown race is the new meta. Given people 12 sort of ways to stop being pathetic. Can you take a joke? Can you, can you, can you be useful? Can you at least be amusing? Like, mm -hmm. can, is there something worthwhile about you? What's up, everybody? Personified here. Today, showing you a different team from the so-called meta. But I consider it to be a safe team because the use of Goddess Liz. Now my version is of course using the main two from that team is a uh, Ram and Amelia. But using what could counter it, and I know for a fact, is Blue Gother. And oh of course there's Merlin as well, but Blue Gother. Now this is my third time I believe or fourth time showing him. And the reason why is because he's a better counter to that that particular team when using uh, Goddess Liz, Merlin, and uh, Amelia because of his debuff card, which disables debuff skills for one turn. And if you get lucky with the 2 and 3 star, will not only decrease attack on all enemies, but will disable buff and debuff. So the only one that could attack is um, Merlin. And then as well as... Um, you know, Goddess Liz's little uh, uh, single, uh, sorry, uh, one star uh, stun card, which doesn't stun, but just attacks. And pretty much, you know, making sure that Amelia and Goddess Liz doesn't do anything for those turns. So it's pretty nice to have. Uh, of course, you already know about Merlin, you know, with her uh, power strike, single target attack, and her AoE of the recovery uh, infect. And then, of course, Amelia, if you hit her twice, she'll freeze you uh, for two turns, I believe. And, of course, having uh, Ram in the back for her passive, giving the increase of basic stats uh, by... I need to double check on the percentage. Uh, by 20% for all allies. So, primarily, she's only good in the... She's better in the, in the back, just to help out the stats for the ones in the front. But... I feel like this is a better uh, meta team than uh, using Goddess Lame, Goddess Liz. But yeah, so of course using CC food because uh, I'm still building up the units. And you know, normally there's a lot of players using safe teams with CC food. So we're gonna do a couple in, in ungeared and a couple in geared. So without further ado, let's jump right into the first match. All right, into the first match, and we got, of course, the per usual safe team. That is Escanor, Goddess Liz, and Gulther. Now, uh, I'm gonna test this out just in case they don't have evasion food. But I'm gonna throw this AOE with uh, Merlin here. You put the debuff and throw that out. So then Gulther doesn't do his uh, pumpkin bombs. All right, so they didn't have evasion food. I right, see we canceled one of Gulther's card. And if, even if they merge a card with Goddess Liz and have her stun, they can't use it. Alright, so for here, uh, we can actually... Uh, let's see what we do. Actually, we can rush uh, Emilia's ult. That's what we're going to do. That's our best bet. Try and get rid of her. Makes sense. Okay. Right, okay, so let's do this. Do that. And then hopefully this freezes uh, Escanor. Let's see if it punctures through. Nice. Perfect, alright. So then the following turn, uh, we didn't get more cards for Amelia. So that's unfortunate. So we're, what we're gonna do is. Alright, so there, there you got frozen. So we're gonna do this. 
do this. I believe this should kill off uh, the revive and then ult, and then this should wipe out the field. Check it out. Oh, I didn't set reset the revive, damn it. Alright, that's fine. Let's check it out. Boom, Goddess Liz is out. Nice. So as you see there, pretty much uh, enables the the field there, uh, making uh, Goddess Liz and go through if they have them, uh, unable to do anything with their debuff skills. So pretty good there. Uh, so they're rushing Eskinor's all. Okay. Still going after Amelia. Makes sense. They do have uh, the debuff immunity, so they won't get frozen. Okay, she died. Never mind. All right. Uh, all right, what are the chances? Actually, we could kill here. So let's do this. Do that. Do that. That should kill off uh, Escanor. We are going to be creating Lost Vein, but we should be fine. Yeah, this kills off Escanor. And lower the health of uh, Meliodas here. Luckily, he didn't have any cards, so he had no crits. All right, so... We're still not done here because, you know, Lost Fane's ult. That's our biggest problem. But we're going to throw this off. Because you see here. Oh, he's got his ult. All right. So as you see here, he decreases attack on enemies by 20%. Sables, debuff, and buff cards. So he's going to be uh, lower down. So we're going to throw these out. We're going to crit him. But at least we have Golther's ult. All right. There's his crit. But we pretty much won here. So we're going to head into the next match. All right, we're dealing with uh, Escanor, Sario, and Gother. They got a lucky start with that uh, rank up. Okay, they are using CC food. They're gonna take her out. All right, so we lost Amelia, but that's okay. We still have uh, Merlin and Gother here, so we're gonna do this that and throw this out so Gother can't do anything and they're gonna be lowered by attack so we should make a comeback hopefully all right we're close to Gother's ult um oh, okay okay uh let's see what we do here all right so they're gonna try to get rid of Gother here because I'm close to his ult oh they actually might be able to Oh, no, never mind. Okay. No damage there. Alright, so let's do this. Do that. And get rid of Escanor. Oh, 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 oh my god. I should have done the AoE, damn it. <laughs> Alright, we got two ults. Let's see who they have in the bag. Most likely. And of course, Goddess Liz, you know, why wouldn't you run her in the back to be on the safe side? Let's see what they do here. We could make a comeback. They're going to go all Sario here and then put up the shield. We still have that decrease, so we should be fine. Ooh, okay, okay, we're, we're fine, we're fine. We could actually make a comeback here. So we're going to do this, do that, and then put this debuff card. We should be able to make a comeback here. This is pretty exciting. They did have high CC. All right, we didn't reset the revive. All right, we should be able to kill off one of their units here. Let's check it out. Bam, only Sario's alive. And pretty much GG there. They used CC food and we just eliminated uh, two of their units. Uh, they're close to getting his ults here, so we might be in a bit of trouble. For only one unit, of course. Trying to get rid of Ram. And we pretty much uh, won here, so we're going to head into the next match. And the opponent forfeits, of course. High CC doesn't always win, but let's head into the next match. And the same thing, this player also got the same uh, star as the other player. We're dealing with the Escanor, Sario, and Gulter team. Now, of course, they probably also have Goddess Liz in the back because of the high CC. They're, they're also using CC food, similar to me. Now they're debating on who will be the actual threat here. Now, of course, it's Amelia, but 
Let's see if they can guarantee a kill. All right, so they're gonna rank up Sario. Interesting, okay. Go for the AoE. Oh, go for Merlin. All right, makes sense. All right, so we're gonna do this. Uh, actually, no, you know what? No, we're gonna do this. What I just saw right now, we can actually uh, rush ult here. So let's do that and freeze Escanor. Okay, so I think we could pretty much wipe out the field. They're, they're gonna guarantee killing uh, Merlin here, but let's see if they can kill off Amelia. Now they do attack twice. They are gonna get frozen if they don't kill her. So let's just find out what happens. Double rank up. AOE. Oh, damn it. I needed her, but... Let's see if we get more cards for Amelia. We could win this one. They were using high CC. Ooh, we don't. Uh, but we're gonna throw this out. Throw this Golter card out just in case. And just see if he wipes him out. Check it out. We do have her 6-6, so let's see the damage here. Amelia, get us back. Ooh. All right, not, not, not too bad, not too bad. All right, we did lower the health though. That's pretty, got, <laughs> pretty good. Let's see what they have in the back. They of course had Lost Fan. All right, this might be this might pose a threat for us, but we do have Gothers ult coming up. Uh, what we gonna do? Okay. Right. So. Ooh. Right, so let's do this. Oh, actually, wait. Let me move cards. Boom. And then freeze. I'm gonna say sorry. Let's check it out. Perfect, all right. All right, so I, I believe Ram is still alive, hopefully. Even if she gets hit by Lost Vein, she should still be alive. Let's check it out. If she's still alive, we're, we're A-OK -okay on this. Damn Alright, that's fine, that's fine. We still have the ult, so we should be fine here. Alright, so... We're gonna ult, and then... Throw this card out onto uh, Sario here. So Gother should be dead. And we freeze you, you don't have no cards, hopefully it's all Sario, and then uh, we're gonna try to get... Hmm. And we have to get Golther's ult again. Actually, you know what? No, I know what to do. We may risk in critting, but... I mean, we're pretty close here, so... Uh, as you saw, attack twice, but we're gonna... We're gonna kindly release him. That get rid of uh, Sario here, and Sario's gone. All right, now we got to be dealing with Lost Vein here. Uh, hopefully, we got a freeze card, and then we can get uh, Amelia's ult. Oh, we don't. Uh, actually, we, we should be perfectly fine here. All right. So let's do this and this. Now we have Golther's ult. I mean, we pretty much won here, so we're gonna head into uh, pro probably one more match in Ungeared. All right, we're into the final match. We, we beat them with CC food. And the opponent forfeits. And you know what, we'll end it there. There you have it. As you saw, the player was kind of scared for facing this team. But there you have it. What I think is a bit better than using Goddess Liz because she's only targeting one unit, whereas Gother does AoE damage with his weak point card and then applies debuffs, uh, disables debuff skills with his uh, one star. <clears throat> 
but there you have it if you enjoyed this video please leave a like and subscribe for more and try out this team blue gother should be used more than goddess Liz because you're guaranteed to at least eliminate two units in the team and he's one unit that you won't even like consider a, a threat but there you have it if you enjoyed this video of course once again leave a like subscribe for more and until next time personified is out